Glory to Jesus Christ. Glory be forever. Dear brothers and sisters, thank you for tuning in. Please join us in praying the Stations of the Cross. Blessed be our God always, now and forever and ever. Amen. Jesus, my Savior, I love you above all else. With my whole heart, I am sorry for having offended you, and I promise never to do it again. You have said, if anyone wants to be a follower of mine, let him renounce himself and take up his cross and follow me. I want to follow you throughout my whole life. Accept, O oh Lord, the spiritual sacrifice of the way of the cross for your greater glory, for the benefit of my own soul, and for the easing of the sufferings of the souls in purgatory. Amen. Amen. The first station. Jesus is condemned to death. Jesus stands silently condemned to death. The people shout, crucify him, crucify him. It is his great love for us despite our hateful sins that has brought this to pass. He is to die because we are guilty. He becomes guilty on our account and is to be punished for our sins. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long suffering, O Lord. My loving Jesus, it was not Pilate, but my sins that condemn you to death. I beseech you, by the merits of this sorrowful journey, to assist my soul in its journey towards eternity. I repent with my whole heart for having offended you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. I beseech you, be not my judge, but my Savior at the last judgment. From this time forward, I will not judge anyone unless myself in the sacrament of confession. Mary, stand by me before Jesus on my day of judgment. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Heavy suffer the The second station, Jesus accepts the cross. Jesus takes upon himself the cross to justify us before the Father for our many sins. After all the humiliation and abuse, he takes the cross which is really our cross. For it is the thoughts, words, and deeds against the will of God that weigh on his shoulders. Jesus told us, if a man serves me, he must follow me. Wherever I am, my servant will be there too. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long suffering, O Lord. O oh, Jesus, I love you. I know that the way to heaven is the way of the cross. 
please give me the courage and the strength to carry my crosses patiently and without complaint. Mary, Mother most patient, intercede with God for the grace to love my cross and to recognize God's will wherever I go. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Just a short distance from the place of condemnation, Jesus can no longer bear the weight of the cross. His very feet drag over the cobblestones. His scorched and beaten body can no longer carry the burden. He falls. We often feel the weight of our daily crosses. But what do we do? We complain and offend our loving God. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long suffering, O Lord. Loving Jesus, it is no wonder that you fall under the weight of the cross. On it you carry the weight of my sins and the sins of the world. Forgive, Forgive my sins, sins, and I resolve not to repeat them again. again. Give me, O oh Lord, the grace not to commit them again. Mary, Mother of mercy, intercede with God for the grace of true penance. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy, have mercy, have mercy on us. The fourth station, Jesus meets his blessed mother. Deserted by his apostles and disciples, Jesus struggles towards Golgotha. Who does he see standing out from the crowd? His most blessed mother. Their eyes meet. 
her son beaten, bleeding, fainting under a heavy load. The sword of pain and sorrow pierces her heart. Who can understand their pain? Who is the cause of it? Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long-suffering, O Lord. O Son of God, O Mother of my Savior, it is I who have caused your suffering. With all my heart I am sorry. Forgive me, I will sin no more. Mary, Mother of God, intercede with God for the grace of strength to withstand the temptation of sin. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy, have mercy, have mercy. The fifth station, Simon of Cyrene helps Jesus. <coughs> Jesus struggles until he can struggle no more. He stops. His arms and legs have lost all strength. He can go no further. That is why they force Simon of Cyrene to carry the cross. Blessed are you, Simon, that you help Jesus carry his cross. And I too can be blessed if I carry my crosses willingly and follow after Jesus. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long-suffering, O Lord. Jesus, enlighten me with your grace so that I come to you, lovingly carrying my crosses, and in doing so, earn a place in your heavenly kingdom. Mary, our refuge, help me to be sensitive to the misfortunes and hurts of others, and to be quick to help them. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy. Christ, 
и хрестностей помогает, хочешь с Христом не бежите, в мисли хрест радоносите. The sixth station, Veronica wipes the face of Jesus. <coughs> As Jesus walks along the road of torture and humiliation, Veronica realizes the pain that he is suffering. As Jesus nears the place where she is standing, Veronica steps out from the crowd and gently wipes his face. Veronica doesn't think of herself and what the others might think of her. Of all the people, only she has the courage to help Jesus. She is rewarded by clear imprint of his face on the white cloth. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long-suffering, O Lord. Jesus, let the image of your suffering face remain always before me, especially in times of temptation. Mary, Mother most sorrowful, Help me to always remember the sufferings endured for us by your Son. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Having Jesus falls the second time. Unable to continue, completely drained of strength, Jesus falls the second time. His weakness is extreme and he suffers greatly. His second fall reminds us that we must not fall back into sin, especially grave sin. Each time he falls, the soldiers force the cross upon him again. Out of love for us, he rises and goes on. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long suffering, O Lord. O my soul, look upon the fallen Christ and exclaim, Jesus, it is my sins of pride and greed that have felled you. I am overcome with remorse and having contributed to your suffering. Mary, Mother of God, help me to make a true act of contrition and help me to amend my life. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, 
now and forever and ever. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy, have mercy, have mercy on us. The eighth station, Jesus speaks to the women of Jerusalem. I admire you, Jesus, in spite of your most painful sufferings, in spite of your extreme weakness, you worry about other people and you want to help them. You meet these holy women on the road to Calvary. They weep. You tell them not to cry over you, but to weep for themselves and for their children. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long suffering, O Lord. Jesus, it is I who should cry because of my sins and the sins of our people. To weep over you will prove of no avail if we do not amend our Christian life. Touch us with your grace that our hearts may repent our shortcomings and fall from grace. May Mary, refuge of sinners, guide, guide me to, to the reward merited, merited by, the by the precious blood of your Son, my Savior. Our, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for, for us sinners, sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Glory, Glory be to the, the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, Spirit now and forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, so The ninth station, Jesus falls the third time. Jesus becomes weaker and weaker. He stumbles and walks along with great pain. Within sight of the place of execution, he falls a third time. This is the most painful fall. He lies unconscious, bleeding on the ground. Instead of receiving sympathy, he receives blows and insults until he rises again. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long suffering, O Lord. O most powerful, eternal God, I in my blindness have fallen so often into sin and have added to your pain and suffering. I humble myself at your feet and beseech you. Help me to have the firm desire to correct what is devious in me. I resolve to quit sinning. From now on, I want to live as one of your faithful disciples, as one of your friends. Mary, protectress of sinners, 
extend to me your healing hand. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy, have mercy, have mercy on us. Peace. The tenth station, Jesus is stripped of his garments. Oh, what shame with humiliation and what hurt when they tore off the garments that stuck to his wounds. Naked with only the crown of thorns on his head, he stands before the jeering mob. They took all he had, but they cannot take his love. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long suffering, O Lord. Lord Jesus, source of all goodness, forgive us and forgive me. Forgive all our sins. You, you have expiated them in the excruciating pain you endured. With bitter tears we cry to you, forgive the immorality of our lives. Mary, Virgin Most Pure, prevent us from becoming the prey of sinful pleasure. Help us detach ourselves from things of the earth. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy, have mercy. The eleventh station, Jesus is nailed to the cross. Jesus is stretched out upon the cross. His hands and feet are nailed to the cross. The pain is excruciating. His body quivers in anguish. In that anguish he calls to the Father, Father, forgive them. They do not know what they are doing. He forgives his executioners. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long suffering, O Lord. O Jesus, crucified.
crucified. It is my sins that have nailed you to the cross. Fixed to the cross, you are lifted up, so that I can be free of the tyranny of evil. How can I thank you? I resolve to renounce sin and to become your servant. Mary, Mother of the Suffering Christ, intercede for me, that my iniquities may be cleansed from my soul by the blood of your suffering Son. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy, have mercy, have mercy on us. The twelfth station, Jesus dies on the cross. In terrible agony, Jesus looks upon the two people closest to his heart, his mother and the disciple he loved. Woman, this is your son, this is your mother. With these words, he passes on the motherhood of Mary to all of us. Now I am her child. In darkness and earthquake and awesome occurrences, Jesus dies, causing the centurion to say, in truth, this was the Son of God. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long suffering, O Lord. Lord Jesus, you remember me as your suffered agony on the cross. Thank you for the wondrous gift of your blessed mother. I will always be thankful for your forgiveness, and in return I will strive to forgive all who have wronged me. Mother Mary, accept me as your child, and be with me at the hour of my death. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy, have mercy, have mercy on us. The 13th 
13th station, Jesus is taken down from the cross. <clears throat> the body of Jesus is taken down from the cross. Mary holds the body of Jesus to her broken heart. The pain in her heart is written in her tear-filled eyes. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long-suffering, O Lord. O Jesus, I know that I have caused this. Most dear Mother, Meet the cross, you accepted me as your child, and along with your son, you forgave me. I will never again sadden you with my sins. Be with me throughout my life, and at the hour of my death. Mary, Mother of your Savior, and our Mother, intercede on our behalf with your Son, that he may give us the grace to avoid sin. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son, Jesus is laid in a tomb. His life seems to be a complete failure. Apparently, this is the end of the good news he preached. In the end, Jesus is laid in a tomb. A great sadness came over John, the apostle Jesus loved. Joseph of Arimathea, Nicodemus, and the pious women, when they placed the body of Jesus into the tomb, the greatest sadness was in Mary's heart. Glory to your passion, O Lord. Glory to your long suffering, O Lord. Most precious Jesus, at your grave I fall on my knees, and with a guilty heart I call to you as did the thief on the cross. Remember me, Jesus, when you come into your kingdom. Mary, Mother of God and my Mother, help me to always receive the most precious body and blood of your Son in the Eucharist with a pure and grateful heart. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son of God, 
Have mercy, have mercy, have mercy on us. Novim hrobim vše spočilo, daj si a tiše spasatilo, že i kamin privkrivo je, Сторожу пила ставляем. Jesus Christ, my Savior and my God, during this way of the cross, I have come to know of your never-ending love and mercy for us sinners. Your suffering and death have justified me before your heavenly Father. You have taken away my sins and have presented me guiltless before God. How can I thank you? Words could not begin to express my gratitude, except at least this way of the cross that I have walked spiritually. Permit me to remember always the love, the sorrow, and the thanks that I have felt during this journey to the cross. May they guide me to my eternal salvation. If I have gained any merit, may it be for the benefit of the souls in purgatory. Mary, Mother of God, and my Mother, Take me under your care. Amen. Having suffered the passion for us, Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy, have mercy, have mercy. Jak na hrybi su saljane, plin te sljazi, žaj skripljajte, srihi v dušu obmivajte. Bowing our hands and bending our knees in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Jesus Christ, you travel through towns and villages, curing every disease and illness. I do command the sick were made well. Come to our aid now in the midst of the global spread of the coronavirus, that we may experience your healing love. Heal those who are sick with the virus. May they regain their strength and health through quality medical care. Heal us from our fear, which prevents nations from working together and neighbors helping one another. Heal us from our pride, which can make us claim invulnerability to a disease that knows no borders. Stay by our side in this time of uncertainty and sorrow. Be with those who have died from the virus. May they be at the rest with you in your eternal peace. Be with the families of those who are sick or have died as they worry and grieve. Defend them from illness and despair. May they know your peace. Be with the doctors, nurses, researchers, and all medical professionals who seek to heal and help those affected and who put themselves at risk in the process. May they know your protection and peace. Be with our priests and spiritual caregivers. May they know that they are loved and cared for be with the leaders of all nations. Give them the forfeit, foresight to act with charity and true concern for the well-being of the people they are meant to serve. Give them the wisdom to invest in long-term solutions that will help prepare or prevent future outbreaks. May they know your peace as they work together to achieve it on earth. Whether we are at home or abroad, Surrounded by many people suffering from this illness, or only a few, Jesus Christ, stay with us as we endure and mourn, persist and prepare. In place of our anxiety, give us your peace. For you are a God of mercy, kindness and love, and we give glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever. And ever. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
them, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Oh, Christ, Christ. 